in this video, you will see that not only is the composite material in cam shelving elements lighter in weight, it is also very easy to assemble and adjust the shelf positions. We will be assembling an element stationary starter unit, but before we get started, let's make sure we have all the necessary parts. In your package, you will receive all the components needed to assemble a complete unit. The only tool you will need is a rubber mallet. Stationary units ship with pre-assembled post kits. If your post kits are pre-assembled, you can fast forward to the section titled Installing Dovetails. Components needed for assembly. To assemble a cam shelving element stationary unit, you will need four posts, eight wedges, two top post connectors, two bottom post connectors, eight stationary traverses, 32 stationary dovetails, 16A and 16B, shelf plates for four shelves, and a stationary assembly instruction manual. Post kit assembly. Also, we recommend you have an additional person to assist you in assembling the shelving unit. If you look closely on the posts, you will notice that the recessed design on each of the sides is different. The side with the Canberra product code label should always be facing inward. Start by attaching the wedges on the first notch of the top of the posts, one on each side. You will hear them click into place. Now repeat the same on the second post. We will then attach the top post connector. The top post connector is solid on top. The bottom post connector is open on both sides. We will use only the top post connector for this part of the assembly, so we will set the bottom post connector aside for now. Next, attach the top post connector to the posts over the wedges on each end. Using your rubber mallet, gently tap on each end until the top post connector is set into place. Do not tap on the center. Next, we will install the bottom post connector. The bottom post connector is open on both ends. To make it easy, you can tilt the post kit to insert the posts. Push the bottom post connector a few notches to give you enough room to insert the bottom wedges. Now we will attach the bottom wedges and bottom post connector. For stationary units, it is important that the bottom post connector is installed on the second notch from the bottom. This helps provide better stabilization. Attach a wedge on each side just as you did on the top you will hear them click into place. Using the rubber mallet, secure bottom post connector over the wedges until the post connector is installed completely. We have just assembled a post kit. Now repeat the same instructions to assemble your second post kit. Installing dovetails. Now that you have assembled your two post kits, it is time to install the stationary dovetails. Take a set of dovetails, 1A and 1B dovetail. The A dovetail is always in your right hand and the B dovetail is always in the left. You will notice how these connect together. Posts come standard with notches every 4 inches for custom shelf spacing depending on your storage needs. Starting from the bottom, attach the dovetails onto the post. To make it easier, install one dovetail at a time. Locate the dovetail placement notch and angle the dovetail to make it easier to secure the dovetail into place. Now try the other dovetail and then snap them together until they are both locked into place and connected. Repeat the same instructions on the other post. Make sure you count the notches to ensure you attach the dovetails at the same level. Installing Traverses We will now install the traverses onto the element stationary unit. 
You will notice that the traverse end pieces that attach to the post are labeled A on one end and B on the other end. The A side of the traverse will always be on your right side and the B on your left side. Another way to tell if you are installing the traverse in the right direction is the screw is always facing down. Attach the traverse by inserting the traverse end piece onto the post. Insert the end piece into place on each side. Using your rubber mallet, tap gently on each end so the traverse slides in evenly on each side. Continue to do this until the traverse end piece is attached all the way onto the dovetail on both sides. Do not hit the center of the traverse with the mallet. Repeat the same on the opposite post. Remember, the traverse end piece labeled A is always on the right. Now, install the dovetails on the opposite post and repeat the same instructions on the other end. Make sure you count the notches to ensure that you are attaching the dovetails at the same level as you did on the opposite side. Install the dovetails A on the right hand and B on the left hand. Install the traverse applying the same instructions as before. Determine the position where you want your next shelf to be placed. For our next shelf, we are going to count five notches up. We will repeat the same instructions for each of the levels until all the dovetails and traverses are attached. Another benefit of elements shelving, in addition to being very easy to assemble, is that the shelves can be easily adjusted without having to disassemble the entire unit or disrupting the storage space below or above. In this video we will also demonstrate how to do this. Installing Shelf Plates Now that we have installed all the dovetails and traverses, it is time to complete our assembly by adding the shelf plates. Our shelf plates are labeled END and include a cutout so it makes it easier to identify what shelf plates are designed for the ends. There you have it, we have just assembled Cam Shelving Element Series Stationary Unit. Adjusting Shelf Positions First, remove all the items and shelf plates. Using your rubber mallet, gently hit the traverse from the bottom up on each end to deattach from the dovetails. Use the same tap technique on each end. Remove the traverse by twisting in and out and then follow by removing the dovetails. Repeat on the opposite post. Reattach the dovetails at the preferred level and insert the traverses using the same technique. Replace the shelf plates and you are done. You can count on Cambro to be on the leading edge of technology, innovation, and food safety. Elements lightweight material makes it easy for anyone to assemble a unit. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to discover more features of Cam Shelving Elements series.